Biden administration has picked the Pacific Northwest as one of the country's new hydrogen hubs. Environmental reporter Kale Williams breaks down the billion dollar investment. The administration is billing this as a regional network of businesses, local governments and labor groups that will help bring down the cost and the environmental impact of producing hydrogen fuel. Hydrogen has been seen as a potential solution to some parts of the economy that put out a lot of carbon dioxide and are hard to electrify. Things like heavy industry, construction, and trucking. And that's because when hydrogen is used as a fuel, it emits only water vapor, zero carbon dioxide. But it hasn't caught on yet because it's ridiculously expensive and takes a ton of energy to produce, which can sometimes cancel out any of its environmental benefits. But what sets our region apart is that we've already got a lot of renewable energy from wind, solar and hydro that the administration is hoping can help make some of the cleanest hydrogen around and at a lower cost. Oregon Congresswoman Andrea Salinas joined us for Straight Talk earlier today, and she said the Pacific Northwest makes a lot of sense for this kind of investment. You know, the Pacific Northwest really has been working on moving to clean energy, whether it's, you know, our renewable portfolio standard, our um, clean fuel standard. We have been moving in that direction for a while, and I think this just fits in with the work that we have been doing. Now, if you're thinking you're going to power your truck with hydrogen fuel from this project next week, you're going to have to slow your roll just a little bit. This is estimated to be a nine year project, and we're only in the first phase, but it does have the potential to play a big role in transitioning away from fossil fuels.